Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I want to talk about three settings that you need to change today if you have Galaxy Watch Ultra. So let's get started. The first one is LTE. Now, if you have Galaxy Watch Ultra, it only comes in one model, which is the LTE model. So by default, you have LTE capability as well. You can get an eSIM and use the watch separately from your phone. But if you are not using LTE, consider turning LTE feature off. When I turn this feature off on my Galaxy Watch Ultra, I gained one whole day of extra battery life, which was great. The second feature that you need to set up today on your Galaxy Watch Ultra is the Find feature. You have a Find app on your watch as well as on your phone. The benefit is that if you turn this feature on, you can track your watch wherever it is from your phone. So go into the apps, go in the Find app, and here it will ask you permission for your location. So grant that permission. And once you do that, you can see all of your devices on the watch. And if you tap on them, you can actually see their live location on the watch. Now you can do the same from the Find app on your phone. Go into the Find app and you will see all your devices listed here. Tap on Galaxy Watch Ultra and you will be able to see the location. Now this is important because in case you lose your watch, you forget it somewhere, you're not finding it, you can find your watch through the Find app on your phone. And if you lose another Samsung device, and you have your watch with you, you can go into the Find app and you can locate that device as well. The third thing that you need to do on your Galaxy Watch Ultra is to run the diagnostics on your watch. You can do this by going into the wearable app, going settings, then going device care. And here at the bottom, you will find the diagnostic section, tap on it and it will take you to the diagnostics page where you can run diagnostics on your phone as well as on your watch tap on your watch and here you can run diagnostics almost every physical component of your watch you have things like battery status eSIM, power restart sensors mobile network touch screen button speaker vibration wrist detection wireless charging bia sensor ecg sensor nfc mic you name it if you think there is some problem with your watch or if you want to see the starting point of your watch and you want to make sure that all the physical components of the watch are running properly you can run this diagnostic test and i advise you do it today so these are the three most important things you need to set up on your galaxy watch ultra today i hope this was useful i will see you in the next one till then take care Bye bye